Ephesians 2.20, it says, Having been built on the foundation of the apostles and prophets with Christ Jesus himself as the chief cornerstone. So what do you expect when a foundation is taken out? Yes. And it's just like a house. You could do without the roof, but you're going to get a little wet, but at least you, have, you can get an umbrella or something. But when you don't have a foundation, I mean, you just have zero house. It's just like there's many churches that call themselves a church of Jesus Christ, but there's no kingdom of God. It's not the fullness of his kingdom. They don't know what they're missing, so they're not truly bringing the kingdom to earth. The kingdom is about doing things God's way in God's order. The kingdom is about honoring and re revering the Holy Spirit, not about performance. The kingdom is about what God wants, not what we want. The kingdom is about sacrificing everything, surrendering your whole lives. The kingdom is about being selfless, putting others before you. The kingdom is about laying down your dreams and desires and saying, God, whatever you want. That's the kingdom. Amen. But when we don't have things in order, we go completely astray. So it's not even, it's not, I don't know what it is, but it's not the kingdom of God. 